good half of our majors uh, are majoring in what is known as the Communication Arts and Literature program, and that is the program we teach that in combination with the communicate with the Communication Studies um, department. That's the program that prepares students to be secondary uh, education uh, teachers to, to teach K through 12. Uh, what 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 it used to call you know being an English teacher now it's Communication Arts and Literature in the state of Minnesota. So they teach English, but they also teach Communication Studies. And uh, we have a, a program for that. Uh, they take a variety of courses in English, literature courses, pedagogy courses, uh, courses in communication studies, education courses. Uh, and uh, at, at the end of that, <clears throat> with student teaching, uh, they're prepared and licensed to teach uh, secondary education in, in Minnesota. So that's, that's one program that students can do. But we also offer a, uh, a number of other majors. Uh, students can do a general English major, which again gives them uh, experience with, uh, with literature, uh, with writing, uh, with, with uh, a variety of areas within literature and lots of elective possibilities. But they can also elect to specialize. They can do a focus on uh, literature. And again, then they've got guided electives and requirements that emphasize literature, both uh, British and American. Uh, they can do a creative writing major, and that really emphasizes creative writing. They can take courses in uh, prose, nonfiction, drama, uh, playwriting, that is, uh, fiction writing, poetry writing on several levels, and they also can take uh, literature classes along with that. Uh, they can do a linguistics major, uh, which, which is really quite different. And, and, uh, uh, you know, as, as anyone who's, who's worked in the field knows, uh, uh, the difference between, say, a, a literature major and emphasis and a linguistics one is quite different. Uh, uh, linguistics is really specialized, really focuses on, on the technical aspects of language. Um, lots of students who plan to teach English as a second language will, uh, will do a, a linguistics major and, a, and an English as a second language minor and, and become licensed to teach that. So that's a, that's a program as well. And then there is a, a program in rhetorical and applied writing, and that's for students who are attracted to writing, but not necessarily writing stories and poems and plays and novels and things like that, but, but, uh, but writing uh, uh, more prose nonfiction kinds of things. And that gets students ready for careers working in, uh, in government or, or industry uh, producing text. I'm thinking a little bit about the characteristics that, uh, that our best majors have. And I would say that uh, this is, a, this is a major for readers, uh, students who enjoy reading uh, and enjoy working with texts, talking about texts, analyzing texts. Uh, the, 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 the students who are best uh, at, at the English major tend to be students who, who like to read. Uh, um, often they're students who read on their own or once they've taken some English classes in college, sometimes just get fired up, get turned on by, by reading literature. Uh, and you don't have to necessarily be a literature major, but, but uh, you know, the best teachers are ones who are excited to teach students uh, the books that they cherish, the books that they love, and want to keep adding to that, of course. You don't want to you know, have 20 books that you love and that, that, they, that you can talk about and limit it to that. You want to have that, that, that open-ended uh, exploration uh, of text. But if you're going to be a writer, and this I think is really important, if you're going to write uh, you know, poetry or, or fiction, or if you're going to do magazine pieces, uh, or, or, or even practical writing, you want to be a reader. You want to, to, you want to know what, what other people have written so that you can, uh, you can grow and learn from that. And, and uh, the, more, the more you've read, the more experienced you are as a reader, the more that enriches your writing.